Today on Shredding Spree, we're riding the rocky chunk of Simi Valley. Every time I ride out here, I wonder why I don't do it more often because it's so much fun. And it's close enough to my house that I could basically consider it a local spot. It's no more than a 20 minute drive. I've only ridden a few trails in this area and I think they're sort of the most popular ones, but they never disappoint. And I know that there's a crop of guys that live out here that are always building, making sketchy hits and basically all the stuff that I love to ride. This particular ride was one of the first times I was able to get the Stumpy Evo out in some real chunk to see how it handled it. And as you'll see throughout the video, I'm just having too much fun putting this bike through its paces on chunk like this. Coming off of a hardtail for so long, it's insane to go back onto a bike that's fully suspended, but especially one like this that has so much travel but still pedals so well. So it's really a treat to ride it on this kind of stuff. Anyway, we'll get into the riding here. This video picks up on a trail called The Grudge. Well, it's tough because you're sitting and spinning, your legs are burning, and then you get to those rock things, and you need to drop a couple gears to yeah. make it. You need to have momentum. Yeah. We can't all be like hardtail party, you know? That guy's got some skill. Okie doke, you ready to party? Long on the arms. Yeah. Keys rattling in my swap box. Drive me nuts. Did you get the drop? Yeah. Got my ass hands me though. <laughs> I did the drop. I remember that much. <laughs> it's rowdy. It is. Every time I get to this, it looks a little bigger. <laughs> yeah, this is the spot right here. Wow, was it this big last time? That's what I said. <laughs> I've done this drop a bunch of times in the past, but it's been well over a year since I've ridden this trail. So in a situation like that, with an obstacle that's as blind as this one, I'll always stop and give it a good look before I send it down. Easy peasy, you guys. It's just scary wary. <laughs> oh, dude. You easy. It well, it is easy. <laughs> you don't have to go that fast. You just ride off of the thing. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna do it. No, I'm not gonna try to talk you into it. You pull up a little bit, huh? Yeah. Well, you just take the curb approach. Just ride off of it, and I do like a little timing thing. Like I lift the bars a little bit so I can like. I don't know if I'm not familiar with it and I'm not going really fast. Us a little bit. Yeah, I just carry the front. Okay. Sweet, that's fun. Morning. Morning. How are you guys? Good.
sick. Did you just grind up all those rocks? <laughs> <laughs> I watched too much YouTube. I'm like, this is a bonus line. <laughs> like, just, I'm trying to pay attention to my own line, but I'm pretty sure you went up there. <laughs> yeah. right, a little steep action here. Hey, how are you? Good, how are you doing? Very good. Could use a little less wind, but yeah, it's good. <laughs> Have a good one. One rider behind me. Woo -hoo -hoo, tight. It's pretty hilarious to go through the footage from this ride and just see all the things in my peripheral as I go down the trail. There's bonus lines everywhere. I got to imagine if I were local and riding this stuff weekly that I'd have my own trail within a trail here with all the stuff that you can just pick out and jump onto. Which is kind of what makes terrain like this so much fun is the ability to be creative. Brakes are definitely heating up. <laughs> Brake burner right there. Oh, man. <laughs> Someone tell me how I'm just now noticing how good my guys color coordinated today. The shirt, the socks, the fork. How am I going to compete with that? So fun or stressful? <laughs> I gotta tighten my headset. Some of those drops finally seated my bearings in. At this point we had pedaled back up the hill and we're taking a second run down, this time on a trail called Hummingbird. I don't think the tech on this one is quite as much fun as the Grudge, but it's one of the only other trails I know out there, so that's what we took. One of these days I'll get to know some of the local boys out here and they'll take me around and show me where all the good stuff is. Hey guys, hey. morning. Good. Yo -ho -ho. Tip this up a little bit. Okay, thank you. Sorry? Yeah, yeah, you would go, uh, yeah. it kind of goes up to the left up there. Sorry we stopped. Oh, no worries. The trails are for everyone. I'm going to think it's this way. Eh, let's do it. We're going to get down one way or another. Yeah, even though I've ridden this trail a handful of times before, there's still a handful of forks in the trail that I'm not really sure where they go. Yet another reason to enlist a tour guide one of these days. All right, same decision, part two. Let me see here. Okay, this is Hummingbird. Okay, Doesn't say. It's not on the map. I went to your right on that rounded one and, and bumped down uh, into the hole. I've been lifting the rear to kind of like drop into some of this stuff because I'm so afraid of hitting my bottom bracket with this low ass geo. You feel like you're pedal slapping? I'm pedal striking a lot yeah. on this bike. For uh, height, your geo. 63 in the front and then low. and long and low in the back. So Rowdy. it's the thing is uh, limo right now. Yeah. So I might flip the chips on the horse link to shorten the rear and bring up the bottom bracket a little bit, but leave the 63 and see how that feels. 
Flipping the chips in the horse pivot and leaving the head tube angle in the slack position actually steepens it up to 63.5 degrees, FYI. Morning guys, how are you? Oh yeah, it's busy. Wait till you get to the top. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of people. There's so many lines. <laughs> pointer and go on that one. Uh oh. I always get a little nervous when the homies take a little longer than expected to come down. Bike okay? Yeah. You're okay? You ran out of it? I ran out of it. Every time you start feeling okay. I know, right? <laughs> I'm like, all right, whoa! <laughs> Turns out my guy had a little OTB moment, but luckily was able to run out of it. So no harm, no foul, except for his shattered confidence. Love you, buddy. Nice. I guess this is the part where you point it downhill. No, this is it. I think it just gets washed away because of this sheet of rock. Pick your line, pick your line. You want to go that way or this way? Hmm. That might give us more riding instead of just going straight down. Yeah, let's go that way. Morning, guys. We're basically locals. Really know how to stretch out the runs. Oh, that's fun stuff. It's nice to ride stuff. You gotta think about. I need to go home and fill the big hole with a bunch of pizza or something. Well, that wraps up this week's bike ride, so thanks for watching. We'll be back again next week with another video, but until then, be sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you again soon. Take care.